Mosquitoes love water and humans, which means your pool is the perfect place for mosquitoes to breed and feed. But don't worry, here are a few tips to prevent and get rid of mosquitoes in and around your pool. Let's dive in. Real quick, before we continue, if you want more help taking care of your pool, be sure to grab our free pool care cheat sheet at swimuniversity.com slash cheat sheet. It's totally free and will help you keep your pool clean and clear all season long. First, why are there mosquitoes near your pool? Well, mosquitoes lay eggs in water where they can hatch and grow into adults. Gross, I know. So if you can get rid of the spots where mosquitoes like to breed, you can reduce the amount of adult mosquitoes in your backyard. Now, your swimming pool itself shouldn't be a breeding spot for mosquitoes. Most pools are too deep and have too much chlorine. If your pool water is balanced, your chlorine levels are in check, and your filter system is running properly, it shouldn't be an issue. But if you don't properly clean and maintain your pool or have issues around your pool, it can become a mosquito breeding ground. So here's how to prevent mosquitoes from breeding and living around your pool in the first place. Step number one is to get rid of any standing water. Mosquitoes lay their eggs in standing water. And this means any water that accumulates on top of your pool cover can be a mosquito breeding site. Use a cover pump to remove any water accumulating on your pool cover and do this once a week in the summer. That's about how long it takes for a mosquito egg to hatch into an adult. You'll also wanna properly close and winterize your pool if you plan on keeping it full of water all year round. And don't leave any liners or covers outside during the off season where they can collect standing water. You may also have some spots around your pool where the water lingers, especially after it rains. Buckets, plant pots, or any divots or holes in your yard that stay damp should be emptied, removed, or filled in. And if you have a fountain or other water feature in your yard, keep it in motion to prevent mosquitoes from breeding there. Step number two, skim your pool surface. Mosquitoes can hatch eggs and breed in little shallow water on top of leaves and other debris. So once a week, use a skimmer net to remove anything floating on the surface of your pool. Step number three, secure your pool cover. When your pool isn't in use, keep it tightly covered. Make sure it's secured with a well-fitting cover, like a safety cover, so mosquitoes can't get into the water underneath and repair any rips and tears in your cover as they appear. Step number four, run your filter. Your filter will help keep your water moving. Even running your filter for a few hours a day can add enough movement to your water to prevent mosquitoes from breeding and hatching. Step number five, keep up with your landscaping. Mosquitoes love piles of soggy leaves, rotting logs, and tall, wet grass. Mow regularly, rake and dispose of leaves, and get rid of any rotting logs. Step number six, keep your chlorine levels balanced. Your free chlorine levels should be between one and three parts per million, with three parts per million being ideal. While this won't kill any existing mosquito larva, it makes it a lot harder for them to develop. And if you have a bromine pool, keep your levels between three and five parts per million. So once you've gotten rid of standing water, you can start to get rid of the mosquitoes themselves. There are plenty of mosquito pesticides on the market, but if you don't wanna use any chemicals, there are a few options for killing or deterring mosquitoes if they're around. Number one, use a larvicide like mosquito dunks. Mosquito dunks are small rings that slowly dissolve in your pool and kill mosquito larva. They're organic and made from bacteria that's only toxic to mosquito larva. That means it's safe for swimmers, pets, and your water chemistry. But it can affect pool clarity and surface staining, so it's best to use it when your pool is not being used. One mosquito dunk lasts about 30 days, and they work best in smaller pools. Number two, get a mosquito trap. Mosquito traps use adhesive glue, dehydration, or electric zaps to kill mosquitoes. They're designed to lure mosquitoes with UV lights and CO2. While they won't completely eliminate a mosquito problem, they can reduce the number of mosquitoes if you put them in strategic areas. Number three, shock your pool regularly. Shocking your pool weekly during the pool season can help keep your water clean and prevent mosquito larva from developing. Chlorine-based shock is the most effective at removing contaminants and killing anything growing in your water. Number four is to install a pool enclosure. If you live in a humid climate with a huge mosquito problem, consider installing a pool enclosure. This can be made of mesh, 
glass, fiberglass, and built around and over your pool area to keep insects out. Number five, install yellow bug lights. Insects, including mosquitoes, can't see yellow, so yellow light bulbs won't attract them. These are especially useful if you enjoy swimming at night. Number six, use a fan. Placing a large fan near outdoor gatherings can keep the insects away. Mosquitoes are weak flyers, so a fan might be a good deterrent. Oh, and one final note on citronella. You've probably heard of citronella candles or torches used as mosquito repellent. Turns out the amount of citronella oil put out by candles and torches isn't that effective. So be sure to follow other mosquito repelling tips, especially getting rid of any standing water on or around your pool. And if you want more help maintaining your pool throughout the season, grab our free pool care cheat sheet at swimuniversity.com slash cheat sheet. And if you found this video helpful, leave a comment, hit the like button, and subscribe for more pool maintenance tutorials throughout the season. That's it. Thanks again, and happy swimming.